Hey Jelly Babes, welcome back to my channel. I hope you're all well. So I thought that I would choose some different fall colours today as I've done lots of orange and reds so I wanted to do something a little bit different. So I am using my much loved Madame Glam polishes. So I've got Boat Trip and Vivid Purple. So you've got these sort of cooler tones that are perfect for this time of year. And I'm using this plate, I haven't even used it before as you can see. I have every intention of reviewing this blogger collaboration set that I've got. I just haven't got around to it recently. I kind of wanted to just do some designs. So this design today is kind of my take on the new Moyu plates. You know, the Trend Hunter, I think it is, or something like that. Um, I haven't got around to buying it, but I absolutely love the look of the images on that plate. And I just had to kind of try and improvise and try and create it myself. And it's sort of my take on it, because obviously I don't have the same images. But you kind of have a lot of these like squared backgrounds or played back backgrounds backgrounds even <laughs> and ideally I would have liked some like sunflowers or something like that to put on the bottom but I didn't have anything that would kind of work so I thought that I would just put on things that I love which are butterflies and um, I'm sort of quite happy with how the look has ha uh, has come out so what I love about these Marianne nail plates is that you kind of get the same design but it it go it's put on the plate differently so instead of having to like faff around trying to get it to work and fit on the another side of the nail you just kind of line it up and it does all the work for you which is loads better okay so aren't they just gorgeous so I've gone ahead and done it to the rest of the nails I was really unsure on how to finish this design I kind of tried filling it in with sharpies and it just didn't work so then I decided to do like another double stamping effect and I thought that this gold colour worked perfectly and it's still bringing that sort of warmer feel to it and I actually just left the other two white just because I couldn't find a colour that worked with it and I do, I personally think it goes, I don't know what you guys think. And then I'm going ahead and applying the top coat. I've been so indecisive today, Jelly Babes. I couldn't decide which worked best. So I thought that I'd just show you my take on it. So this is the glossy version for all of you that love glossy. Because I know not everyone's a, a fan of matte. And then this is kind of half and half where the purple's matte. And then I quite liked that look. It, it does kind of appeal... But then I settled on completely all matte. I just, I don't know, I'm just loving matte at the moment. But I have shown you all so you can decide which look that you want to sort of use as the end result. So I'm really pleased with how these have turned out. I hope my lovely little jelly babes love it too. Thank you so much for coming and taking the time to check out my tutorial. I really do appreciate it. And until next time, jelly babes, take care. Bye.